Good morning. Welcome to the Pray Mom with PT, a prayer session designed specifically to pray for your children. The Bible says in the book of Psalm 27 verse 4, the Bible says, One thing I ask from the Lord, this only do I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to gaze on the beauty of the Lord and to seek him in his temple. This morning, I want you to lift up your voices with me and begin to declare this word concerning your life, concerning your children, that you will dwell in the house of the Lord, that your life will be a tabernacle, that your life will be a temple worthy for the Holy Spirit to dwell in the inside of you and in the inside of your children. In the name of Jesus, this morning, lift up your voices with me and ask the Lord that this thing do I see that I may dwell in your house, that I may dwell in your presence all the days of my life in the name of Jesus to gaze on the beauty of the Lord and to seek you in the temple in the name of Jesus. Come on, lift up your voices with me that your children will not depart from God, they will not depart from the ways of God, that you will not depart from the ways of God in the name of Jesus. Ratebo Sotoriandebo Jehovah, this morning I come to you and I bless your holy name. I ask that Lord you give me fresh grace, grace to be able to dwell in your presence in the name of Jesus, to abide in you in the name of Jesus, to that my children, oh God, will not depart from you, that they will abide in you just as you abide in them, oh God. In the name of Jesus, that your desire would be to dwell in your house. In the name of Jesus, Father, I bless you. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we prayed. Amen and amen. We have been praying using the letters A to Z. It's episode 5. This morning, we are going to continue with the letter W. And I've said is a question. And I'm saying, W, who am I? Who are you, child? Who are you, son? Who are you, daughter? Who are you, grandchildren? Who am I as a praying mom? This morning, we are going to be declaring the word of God concerning our children, our grandchildren, even ourselves, in accordance to the word of God, who we are. In the name of Jesus, Ratebo Sotoriande, lift up your voices with me. Rekema Shutarianda, Ratua Badu Taliande, son, daughter, you are a child of God. You are a child of light. In the name of Jesus, Rakebo Sotoriadebo Shaki Kalinga, I declare into your life in accordance to the word of God in Ephesians chapter 1. I declare that my child, my children are saint. In the name of Jesus, I am a saint. In the name of Jesus, Aoma Shaki Kariande, I declare that I am blessed with every spiritual blessing in Christ. In the name of Jesus, my children are chosen and they are predestined for adoption to sonship by the Heavenly Father. In the name of Jesus, I declare that my children are accepted by God and they are recipients of His grace. In the name of Jesus, this morning as a pray mom, I declare that my children, my grandchildren, I declare that they are redeemed and they are forgiven by Christ in the name of Jesus. I declare that they are wonderful. In her, they have wonderful inheritance of spiritual riches in Christ Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I declare Jehovah this morning concerning my children and my grandchildren that they have, oh God, access to spiritual wisdom. In the name of Jesus, they have access to insight in Christ by the Holy Spirit. Spirit. In the name of Jesus, I declare that my children are firmly rooted and built in Christ. In the name of Jesus, I declare this morning that my children and my grandchildren have the mind of Christ. In the name of Jesus, they can approach God with boldness. That is who they are. In the name of Jesus, they are complete in Christ. In the name of Jesus, they have not been given the the spirit of fear, but that of 
power, love, and a sound mind. In the name of Jesus, I declare, son, daughter, you have been bought with a prize and you belong to God. That is who you are. In the name of Jesus, you have been adopted to God as, a God's, as God's children. In the name of Jesus, I declare, son, you have direct access to God through the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus, in accordance to the word of God in Ephesians 2, 5 to 6, I declare that children, my children have been raised to, to new life in Christ and they are seated with him in heavenly places. In the name of Jesus, I declare that my children have been saved by grace and through faith in Christ. That is who they are. In the name of Jesus, come on, lift up your voices with me and pray this morning. Who are you? Who are your children? Who am I? Master Terebo Shekeriande W Master Terial Abaso Koriande this morning I declare that my children have been bought by near by near to God by the blood of Jesus. Talinga in accordance to the word of God in Ephesians 2 16. I declare that my children are reconciled to God through the cross of Jesus Christ. In accordance to the word of God in Ephesians 2, 19, I declare that my children are part of God's family. In the name of Jesus, that is who they are. They are partakers in the promises of God in Christ Jesus. In accordance to the word of God in Ephesians 3, 10, I declare that my children are a mirror that display the glory of God to the natural and to the supernatural worlds. In the name of Jesus, that is who they are. Table Sotoriande. Pray with me this morning. My children are citizens from heaven. In the name of Jesus, they have the peace of God. That is who they are. That is who I am. Come and pray with me this morning. I am not condemned. My children are not condemned. In the name of Jesus, they have been justified. In the name of Jesus, they are Christ ambassadors. In the name of Jesus, the Holy Spirit lives in the inside of me. The Holy Spirit lives in the inside of my children. That is who we are. We are chosen above God to bear fruit. In the name of Jesus, my children are chosen of God by God to bear fruit. In the name of Jesus, they are joint heirs with Christ. They share in his inheritance. That is who we are. In the name of Jesus, we are hidden in Christ Jesus. We are chosen by God. We are holy. Come and pray with me this morning. Come I can be assured that all things work together for my children because the Bible says all these work together for those who love him and are called according to his purpose my children my grandchildren they have been they, they have been established they have been anointed and sealed by God that is who they are Monday my children, they are God's co-workers. In the name of Jesus, they are God's workmanship. In the name of Jesus, my children and my grandchildren, they can do all things through Christ who strengthens them. That is who they are. Pray with me this morning. 
من لباس چرینده I can be confident of this very thing that the good work that God has started in the lives of my children that the good work that God has started in my life that the good work that God has started in my household he will be faithful to bring it to all the way to completion in the name of Jesus rashaki karyande reke my children are sanctified they are holy nation in the name of Jesus they are royal priesthood that is who they are in the name of Jesus they have been rescued by God in the name of Jesus my children are grandchildren they are free in the name of Jesus they are free from any condemnation in charges against them in the name of Jesus rasha kekerebo sotoriande kama mashikali adaba rakebo sotoriande x X is for exalt and I'm looking at the second letter in the word exalt. Bible says in the book of Psalm 99 verse 5, Bible says exalt the Lord our God and worship at his foot soul. He is holy. Come on, lift up your voices with me this morning and begin to exalt the name of God concerning the life of that child, concerning the life of life of that nieces or nephews of yours. Exalt his name this morning. Worship him. He is a faithful God. Bible says in the book of Isaiah 25 verse 1. Bible says, Oh Lord, you are my God. I will exalt you. I will give thanks to your name. For you have worked wonders. Plans formed long ago with perfect faithfulness. Come on, lift up your voices with me this morning and exalt him. Because of who you are. Because of who he has called your children to be. Who they are. Come on, we exalt him. Thank him for the wonderful things that he has done in your life. In the life of your children. In your family. In your household. This morning, exalt the name of the Lord. Exalt the King of Kings. Give him praise for the plans that he has concerning you. Long time ago. Because he is faithful to complete it. He is faithful to bring it to an end. He is faithful to establish that which he said he would do. In your life and in the life of your children. Jehovah will bless you this morning. We exalt you. We give you praise in Jesus mighty name. We give thanks. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Thank you so much for joining me again this morning. This broadcast is brought to you from International Prayer and Liberation Ministry. I palm for liberation prayers, deliverance prayers and prophetic declarations. Join us daily for our midnight prayers with Apostle Victor at 11.45 p.m. UK time. For more prayers for your children like this, please subscribe and follow us on our YouTube channel, IPAM Ministry. I would love to hear from you. Please send me testimonies and prayer requests to dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. If you do not receive this audio directly from me and you want to, please Please email me at dpmom at iprayerandliberation.com. If this podcast has been a blessing to you and you would and you would love to share with someone, please share, feel free and share this podcast with someone. God bless you and bye for now.